My dear child, this message is for you. You might not have expected it, but I need to tell you about my plan for you so you can be sure of your purpose. You know how to hear me and recognize my voice because I talk to you every day. From the moment I created you, I've looked after you and kept you safe from hidden dangers and illnesses. I've protected you from the enemy's tricks while you sleep at night. In your hardest times, I'll be there with you, and in your happiest moments, I'll share your joy. Every heartbeat, every breath you take, your whole life and your family are all signs of my deep love for you. Remember all the tough places and times I've pulled you from? You didn't start life in luxury, but from the moment you first saw the light, you became one of my messengers to bring healing to the world. But here's something you need to know. The enemy tried to take your purpose away. My armies of heavenly angels fought a fierce battle to protect you. You faced waves of harsh hatred that tried to break you down. But I came with love. You know me, your true father, the one who always supports and lifts you to fulfill your purpose and mission. I came myself and, with the sword of my word, pushed back the enemy and his armies. I showered you with holy anointing for healing, set you on your feet towards your destiny, guided your path with dreams in your heart, and gave you gifts and talents. I made you my warrior, filled you with my spirit, and ignited an unending flame within you. I equipped you to comfort the nations and to nourish those who suffer with spiritual food. Take my hand and never forget that I will walk beside you, assuring you that you can achieve all your dreams. My deepest desire is to see you happy, which is why I am here to care for you, protect you, and offer you peace. My love for you is real and true. So do not be afraid, for I will never leave you alone. I am your counselor, your friend, and your protector. I have moved heaven and earth to ensure your victory. I do not want to see you fail. I have paid the price for all your sins. Now is the time to open your heart to my grace and accept my forgiveness. Even though there are people who want to see you fail, they will soon see how I can help you succeed despite their wishes. Now come with me, and we will walk together. Trust in me without doubt. Let my love strengthen and transform you. There is no place for sadness or fear when you are in the palm of my hand, for I always watch over you. Come, do not fear your enemies. I am your protector. When you face them as a brave warrior, I will be there to give you my hand and lift you up. I will give you victory. It is time to entrust your future to me and stand up. Today I offer you a plan. You cannot refuse. Put your life in my hands. Give me all of yourself. It does not matter if there are mountains to climb or deep valleys to walk through. I will guide you and open the way. But I want you to be strong and courageous, to firm your steps. Even if you walk through the valley of shadows or the darkness, if you pass through turbulent waters, you will not fear. You will not look for excuses to abandon your dreams. You will not be a coward. You will persevere. And even when you feel very tired, you can strive more. I have given you the power and ability to overcome your discouragement and to cast out the bad habit of blaming others for everything. You have a purpose, a mission, and a commitment to me. No one else is responsible. Do not expect others to come to help you. If problems arise, if difficulties come, do not complain that no one calls to encourage you. I am with you, and that should be enough. There are people who criticize you, reject you, and look for ways to bring you down. But you do not need to be loved and accepted by those who have made pacts with your enemies. My love is enough for you. My grace will see you through. I will bless and prosper your home. You have a calling and a mission. My promise remains firm. I will surround you with prosperity, peace, health, and provision. 
Be right with me, fulfill your part of our commitment, and see with joy how the windows of heaven open with abundance and provision for your life and home. I love you, and you will love me more each day. Tell me that you will. Your words move me. I am pleased when you seek me, when you pray, when you worship and praise me. I love to hear you say that you love me. I know it is true, and you have shown it to me many times with your faith and attitude. You show me every day that I have the first place in your life and that you depend on me. My child, I love you, and you know it. I want you to forget your worries for a moment today and spend more time with me. In this time of prayer, I pour out my grace on you and bless you. It is here that I strengthen your heart and reveal my love. It is my will to lead you to a better place, to prosper you in times of difficulty, to make your face and life shine, illuminating all around you in times of struggle. My love will sustain you in days of crisis. You will not be alone when you pass through deep rivers. You will not drown. Even if you must walk through fire, you will not be burned. This is the reward and blessing I give to those who love me and who give me their hearts, to those who are not ashamed that I am their God and Lord. You are my child. Enjoy it. Feel happy knowing that you can come to me with confidence and ask for what you need. Accept my word and my will. Let it give you the peace that I hear your prayer and will answer you. You know very well that if I do not give you an immediate answer, you can wait with patience because, in the end, I will give you what is best for your future, your family, and your soul, so that everything will go well for you and you will lack nothing. Come and taste my grace. Enjoy my mercy. Take some time in my presence. Let me cover you with my glory. As I said before, I am very pleased when you come to seek me. Even if, during your journey, you close your eyes for a minute and dedicate a few words to me. Every time you do, you will feel how my presence fills your heart and my spirit comforts your soul. I love you. Receive this truth today. I love you and want you to move forward with more faith, more strength, more wisdom, more love, and more respect for my word, for yourself, your family, and others. I want you to tell me now if you truly believe in me. I can do so many things for you, but I really need your trust. I want your heart. I long for your faith. Bring me these gifts, and I will help you with everything else. I will make your face shine in a powerful way that will touch the souls of those who need me, bringing health to your body and youth to your spirit. I will give you an unbreakable vision and spirit that you have never seen before. I will make you a testimony to the nations and put the power of life and death in your words. You will wake up every morning brimming with faith and I will be by your side, attentive to your prayers, telling you, Ask me, and I will give to you. I am the Almighty God, helping the needy, healing the sick, rescuing the poor from the pit. I want to manifest my power and glory in those who believe in me. I can change your life in a second, but it is necessary for you to commit to believing in me so you can stand firm. Your enemies do not want you to change. They know all the blessings you can receive and that you can become a respected person, surrounded by holy prosperity and able to help many people. That is why they oppose your rise and will try to destroy you. For this reason, let us make a pact of love here and now. If you believe my word, I will strengthen you in good times and bad when struggles come and when you are called. When the day does not start as you expected, and when night comes, and you have received the provision you needed, I will be there. I tell you again, I will be by your side, and I will sustain you. It is necessary that these trials prepare you, because the blessings that are coming are so great, and before you receive them, 
you must be filled with wisdom and maturity. It is my will and desire that your emotions always remain stable, not swayed by any surprise, nor sinking into sadness when problems come. This is the truth. Many face difficult situations, struggles, and needs, but you are one of my strongest warriors. You are very special to me. That is why the enemy comes to battle you. But if you stay firm in my promises, no one can take away your faith or your security for my armies surround you. Anything you need to achieve victory will always be available to you through your faith. Just bring me your prayers and I will provide. When you are greatly blessed, I do not want you to blow a trumpet or go out into the streets to show off. I forbid you from boasting about all that I give you. Do not provoke envy. Do not draw the attention of enemies. Do not make the mistake of acting imprudently and attracting that devourer back into your life. They already robbed you once. I do not want it to happen again. The blessings you receive are for you to help your family and others with prudence and in silence. I am speaking very seriously, using this medium to get your attention. I will bless you greatly, and that is the truth, and no one can stop me. But I want you to be a faithful servant. Believe in this. Everything you do with prudence and wisdom I will multiply. Seek my presence daily, bow your heart, and come to see me early. I will guide you from now on in every step you take. Do not forget I know you very well. I know your virtues and your mistakes, and I do not reject you for your imperfections. What I want to see is your simple, persistent, persevering, firm, and unbreakable faith. My eyes roam the world every day, and today I'm watching you. I have heard your cry and see how much you truly long for my divine touch, a loving embrace. You know who I am, and the day is coming when you will know me in reality, not just by hearsay, but your eyes will see me. My glory can be shown to whoever I choose, and I can give you powerful revelations to help you grow more. So today, shed these clothes of sadness and put on your new garments of joy, purity, and sincerity. I have come to bless you. Tell me if you want to open the door of your heart and receive me. This is the time to draw near to me. This year, I will transform your life and work great miracles in you. My powerful hand is touching your heart. Receive this message and keep it with love. Let your face light up with a smile because your soul knows and feels that I, your God, your omnipotent Father, I'm taking you by the hand, wherever you are. So I'm determined to make you even braver than you already are, and to remove all those fears and anxieties that sometimes paralyze you and fill you with timidity. In the heavenly kingdom, there is a supernatural battle for your life and your family. That is why I am strengthening you and making you a determined and decisive person. Everyone around you will notice that I have given you authority. You will not retreat when storms threaten you. You will not flee from enemies, nor will you turn back. When you pray, believe. When you cry out, trust. When you come before my presence with great need, bow your head in reverence and extend your hands to receive your answer. I am the creator and author of faith the assurance that you will receive the good things you hope for, the certainty that you will have what you cannot see. With this faith, you will fight and overcome. You will rise against all giants and destroy them. You will not listen to the mockers who see you as small and think they can crush you with a finger. They do not know, nor can they imagine until they see it, that your Father is the Creator of the universe, and I am here ready to defend you from anyone who thinks of harming you and wants to trample your faith. You will overcome, even if you do not feel strong, even if you lack the resources or means to battle those who think themselves powerful. I am your protector, your shield, your advocate. So rise with determination now because, holding my hand, 
you're much stronger than you think. I'm giving you the power and skill to defend the innocent. I'm pouring out this holy oil upon your life, filling you with courage. You have the faith to defeat diseases with my word on your lips. The enemy armies will flee from you. Rise, my child. Cling to this blessed love. Stand up, receive my gifts and your blessings. I will place the crown of victory on your head myself. Here I am to help you. I come to give you my hand, take it, and you will be filled with peace. The end of your sadness has come. The days of your despair are over. I want to show you my love and my tenderness. Open your life to my presence and my love. I want you to feel and understand that no one will ever love you as much as I do. I know everything that goes on in your heart and mind. Sometimes the pain is so deep that you've thought about giving up and surrendering. It's been a long time since you last felt the desire to get up and start a new day full of energy and joy. Close your eyes, put your hands on your chest, and begin to feel how I fill you with love, sincerity, and peace. I am attentive to your prayers in your moments of affliction. Very soon you will see with your own eyes how you will be delivered, strengthened, and lifted by my love and power. Love me, seek me. Kneel and cling to believing. You have many problems, but I make you stronger. Many situations come, but your faith in me makes you brave. Do not fear your afflictions. Face your struggles and battles. Keep your eyes on my promises and words. On all the things I have spoken to, lift your heart. The wind of adversity blows strongly upon you, but you have come to me, crying out for my help. Upon hearing my powerful voice, the winds and storms will cease. I will strengthen your spirit. Stand upon the rock so that you can withstand the conflicts of this life. Raise the sails of your boat. Do not be afraid to set sail. And even if the waves of the roaring sea strike your hopes with hurtful insults, keep your eyes on me, on my love, on my power. Because I am your captain, and you will not sink. You may feel at times that the burdens you carry are heavy, but I fulfill my promise and help you carry them. Be patient. Do not faint because facing your problems. Today I am filling you with immense strength, so that tomorrow you can rise and not fear. But those who open their minds to negativity, who refuse to believe in my truth, who dismiss my word, who mock this love that seeks, heals, and saves them, those who are not brave enough to believe in a real God, will not receive the blessings I have prepared for those who do believe in me and want to find me. Therefore, you must believe me that any stress or anxiety you face today cannot compare to the joy you will have on that awaited day when you receive your blessing. I have never abandoned you in your moments of weakness. I never forsook you. I took away the anguish from your spirit, and I filled you with joy. If you seek me diligently every day, if you close the doors of your room and come before my presence, if you give me your heart in sublime praise, in supreme worship, if you cry out to me with all your soul, with all your fervor, believe me, I will listen to you, and I will lift you to a better level. You will feel stronger. You will see with joy that it was worth it to give me a place in your heart, to decide to make me your God, your King, and your Lord. I know everything that happens to you. I feel with you what you feel. When you trust me with your life and tell me the things that happen to you, when you place your future and your plans in my hands, there is a celebration here in heaven. And I send thousands of angels to help you. I will solve your problems not with your strength or knowledge, but with my spirit and power. Give me your sorrows, doubts, and fears. Walk boldly, because I hold your hand. Cast away fears, emotions, and vain feelings. 
Do not waste your life on grudges or anger. Do not be enslaved by hatred, envy, or lack of forgiveness. I'm renewing your heart. This entire time of crisis is coming to an end. Soon, a new time of sublime and holy blessing will begin for you. I am giving you the purest love that can exist, and this is something that ends your sorrows and makes you very happy. At this very moment, as you listen to me, you can already feel it. Let's go together towards the total transformation of your life. You will be a blessing to your family. You will be an example for the people around you. Rise and go to the fight, because the victory is already yours. Today, I come and fill you with courage. I remove your fears and strengthen your heart. I will not allow you to go through a process without a purpose. There is a reward after this struggle you are going through. I want to change the vision you have of yourself. You are a person of great value to me, and no matter your past, the victories and defeats you have walked through, my love for you grows ever stronger. Everything you have lived has served to prepare you. The purpose I have for your family and for you will be fulfilled. Do not focus your attention or energy on the failures you see in those you love. This day, all of this will pass. They will grow in stature, wisdom, and spiritual maturity. The people you see today will not be the same after some months. I am going to transform them. Stay firm in prayer. This process will end. Your family will be happy again. There will be harmony and peace in your home. But I ask you to bring to me first all your worries, your prayers, and your sleepless nights. Do not get upset over anything. Let anger not steal that much desired happiness from you. Do not shout things that can hurt others. Do not compare them with anyone. Do not wound their souls. Indeed, there are rules and commandments that must be followed in place, but do not raise your voice now. Never insult anyone. Before imposing discipline in your family, first, calm yourself. Take a few minutes. Ask me to take your hand and breathe divine breath into your spirit. I will guide you to also counsel with love those you love. I will be with you always, from morning till night, and while you sleep, I will sit beside you. I will speak to you of my word, so that you dream of those great plans I have for you. You will sing with happiness and with much strength. You will calmly and peacefully go through all the processes you face. I will never let you face something so big that you cannot bear it. But if at this moment you feel that you can no longer go on, believe me, I tell you myself, you can go forward because the victory is already yours. I already won it for you. Just stand up and march without crying and without complaining. Because, a few steps ahead, you will find the reward for your perseverance, the reward for your loyalty, the fruit of your effort, my way of showing you that I value your faithfulness and your commitment to fight until the end, with your head held high, with determination and dignity. I am giving you so much strength that you will tread on serpents and scorpions, deceiving demons and all the armies of evil, and nothing and no one will ever harm you. This is how I want to see you, full of confidence, with unbreakable courage, and with the certainty that all the beautiful things you hope for will soon come to you. This is your faith, that spark of trust you give me when you open your eyes each morning. You please me greatly. And my way of rewarding you is by doing many wonders in your life. I love you and sometimes I remain silent, contemplating the beautiful future that lies ahead of you. Do not be afraid of the processes, the trials, or the conflicts. In my holy name and holding my hand, face all your problems. Tell me that you will, that you will not let your emotions dominate you nor will you be bound by any illness. I heal you, care for you, provide for you and sustain you. I give you what you need 
and multiply the fruit of your effort. I give faith and firmness to your thoughts, but most importantly today I place in your soul this assurance, the unbreakable conviction that my love for you is so great that even if you fail and make mistakes, I will always love you and help you in everything. This is your daily life, a path full of beautiful surprises, many opportunities and processes that lead you to greater victories. Your face shines with faith and confidence, illuminating everyone who looks at you. Your way of treating people, especially your family, testifies to my power and love and shows the world the wonders I can do in those who give me their hearts. Today, I have told you that all the processes you face have a purpose. So do not be afraid. Let your soul not tremble with fear. Continue on this path with determination, for I will always be with you to give you love, peace, patience, strength, and to breathe happiness and calm into your life. I love you. A time of abundance is approaching for your life. The day is coming when the fruit of all you have sown will be born. The tears you have cried, the prayers you have offered on your knees, this is the year of harvest, of gathering in abundance, of keeping and caring for your blessings with wisdom and patience. Do not waste what I give you. Do not throw away the many beautiful things you will start receiving from today. Look around you. You are very blessed. Recognize that you are in a better situation than many of your enemies. Your greatest blessing is your own life. I am giving you the opportunity to come into my presence every day, to seek me more, to receive my word, and be nourished by it. I want you to understand my plan. It is through this life I give you that you can also have the joy of forgiveness, the valuable gift of your salvation. You're alive, and because of this, it is possible to put my commandments into practice to obey my word and to be free from any curse or anything that wants to harm you and steal your happiness. What a wonderful blessing it is to be alive, to breathe, to love and perceive, to cry and feel. Because you can also cry with happiness and even when you feel sadness, those tears that roll down your cheeks remind you that you're still alive. And as long as you have life, you can come to me and receive the opportunity you need to succeed, to overcome, to leave behind what is causing you harm. Come here every day. I will be waiting for you. Cry here with me, and I will cry with you because I also feel. I love you so much, and I don't like to see you sunk in discouragement. Having life and so many beautiful things you feel so much pain that you cannot perceive my great love. But today I want to comfort you. I do not come to accuse you of anything. Trust in me. I am your forgiveness, your affection, your eternal life, your healing, and your redemption. Feel this divine breeze, this scent of beautiful flowers, this essence of spring. Feel this tender presence that surrounds you this morning, right where you are. I want you to have the assurance that truly a season of holy abundance is coming. Your home will be filled with divine provision. A beautiful time of restoration is coming for you and your family. My child, tell me you believe it. The bad times are coming to an end. The days of pain are about to pass. When your blessings arrive, remember that I send them to you out of love. I watched over you in the midst of conflict. When you walked in the desert, I was your provider. From the day you read these words, renew your faith. There have been many attacks, doubts, trials, and rejections that have diminished the fervor you once had in believing. Return again to the path of trust. Fill your mind once more with my powerful word. I want your faith to be alive and burning so that when abundance fills your life, you will not forget me your God and Lord. Keep crying out. 
Keep praying because there are many things that with your natural eyes you still cannot see. A battle is being fought in the spiritual world. I will bless you, but there is much opposition you must defeat. Your victory lies in your faith, in your persistence, in the constancy and perseverance in prayer. Seek me in the day, in the evening, and in the night. Rise early for intercession. Times are changing for you, and my eyes search the earth for brave warriors like you. I will perform miracles in you and through you. I will use you to bring bread, clothing, comfort, healing, and blessing to many. And while you bless others, you will be greatly blessed in the time of miracles. You must stand firm and upright. I repeat, set aside the things that burden you. Seek my face. Renew your faith. I love you. Today I will visit your home and change your destiny. You have called me in your prayer with faith and sincerity. That is why I have come to rescue you. I have the power and I want to do it. The key that opens the door to miracles is your faith. But I also love you and in whatever condition you are in, you will always count on me. You are suffering and need my help, my love that covers and heals you without judging you, my loving presence that embraces you in silence without reproach. You need my friendly ear that listens to you patiently without interrupting. Tell me that you long for me because that is the truth. Your own strength has reached its limit. This is the moment to recognize your need. I know you and your family are going through a cruel desert where loneliness dries up hope. Your soul is thirsty for love because of so much rejection. Walking burns and you cry out in pain when you step on the hot stones. I understand how you feel. It is difficult to keep walking and believe that even in the midst of this suffering, my hand is holding you. But even so, I have come to protect you from the enemies that attack and wound you. Everything you are going through today is just a purification process. Just as gold shines only after passing through the fire, so will you shine and be purified of the negative things that still exist within you. I tell you this not to exalt you so that you can humiliate your brother, but so that you can extend your hand to help those who are down and out. I want you to abandon anger, vanity, fear, doubt, and lack of faith. Never look to the past because nothing you have lived through can compare to the joy you will have from today onwards. I want you to look for small and large things in your life to be grateful for, to walk with a clear conscience and my virtues in your heart. You are worth more. Your family is worth more. Your future is worth more than money, car, house, profession, job, fame, or popularity. Do not fear losing material things, nor cry over them. Put first what truly has value. Love me and seek me with all your strength. I am your provider, and now I will give you what you need. I will satisfy you with true blessings, open many doors for you and put good opportunities before you. Blessings will rain down on you in abundance. Pay attention to what is happening around you. Remember that I can transform negative things to your favor, so do not despair if at first you face obstacles that you do not understand. Behind every problem and frustration, I am hiding prosperity and abundant blessings. Prepare yourself to wisely manage what I give you. Look in my word for advice to increase the gifts and talents I have placed in your life today. But do not be seduced by material goods. Do not give yourself to fame, nor worry about going into debt to buy vanities. Focus on what is important. Strive to elevate your spiritual life to a higher level. Make an effort to learn from my word and to know me better. I will reveal many things to you. I want you to witness wonderful miracles and be diligent with your health and in all family matters. 
Do not leave anything for later. I give you the strength and intelligence uh, to solve several situations today. I do not want you to be desperate at the last minute for something to go wrong because you did not listen to me and to end up frustrated. Rise and do it. Dare to do it. Your heart is brave. From here I see no cowardice in you. No matter what you feel, do the good things you have to do and do not be afraid. You will receive much and you will lose nothing. If you were to lose something or if people get angry with you, because you have decided to fix your situation and make good decisions, put those people in my hands. Pray for them, but do not listen to their advice or complaints. Those who walk towards an abyss by their own decision cannot help you. I am with you to help you in everything, but put me first and not only will I help you, I will also prosper you and pour out blessings upon you more valuable than gold. Even if you feel defeated and faint, I will resurrect your desires to live. I will strengthen you and lift you from the ashes. Those around you and many generations to come will see how much I have blessed you. I will change your clothes, crown you with honor, and cleanse your paths. Your home will be filled with my glory. Believe me, for this will be so. I love you. Listen to my voice. I have good news for you. Do not be impatient. Trust in me and everything will be resolved. My child, listen to me carefully. I have good news for you, news that will fill you with hope and renew your strength. So do not despair or be anxious. Do not let the shadow of discouragement cloud your vision or the weight of trials make you falter. It is necessary that you learn to believe in me and stop doing things your way. Trust in me because I am your God and Savior, and what I have to tell you will fill your life with blessings and great expectations. You have been going through difficult times, moments of pain and suffering. Uncertainty has taken its toll on you while anxiety and fear are consuming you. You have felt that your strength is running out and that you cannot go on, you have tried to solve the problems yourself, but have failed time and again. You feel alone, lost, and without a way out. But today I want to tell you to take my hand, my child. Nothing is lost. There is a way out. I am with you in every moment, in every place, and in every problem. I love you with an eternal love and mercy that never ends. I have plans for you, plans for your welfare and not for harm plans for a good future and hope. You may not understand why you are going through trials and tribulations, but I assure you that everything has a purpose and meaning. I allow you to pass through the fire of affliction so that you can be purified, strengthened and perfected. I allow you to walk through the valley of the shadow of death so that you can know my presence and the power of my love. So. My child, do not give up, do not be discouraged, do not be anxious. Trust in me, because I am your refuge, your strength, and your ever-present help. Come to me with your burdens and worries, and I will give you the rest you need. Learn to wait on me, to seek my face, and to listen to my voice. And I will guide you on the path of life, along paths of righteousness, where you will find peace and true happiness. Always remember that I am the God of the impossible. I am a God who still performs miracles. Only I can transform your life and heal your diseases. I am the God who restores relationships, the God who forgives sins. And there is nothing impossible for me because I am the Almighty, the Most High, the Sovereign, and the Eternal. Only I can reverse your situation and turn your sorrow into joy, your need into great and precious blessings. So do not worry about tomorrow, dear child. For those who love me, all things work together for good. 
No matter how uncertain the future may seem and how overwhelming the trials may be, I will always provide a way out, and with it, your victory. You only need to come before me with prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, present your requests, and I will give you the answer. I will place my peace within you and the strength you need to keep going. Do this, and you will see how, by faith, I transform your tears into joy, your trials into victory, and your fear into confidence. You will walk with the certainty that I am your God, your protector, and your guide, and that nothing and no one can separate you from my unconditional love. So, do not be discouraged, no matter how far away I may seem, or if you think I do not hear your prayers. I want you to know that I will always be by your side. I did not abandon you in the past, and I will not do so in the future. Understand that I will always be with you, walking by your side. I will never leave you nor forsake you. Trust in my faithfulness and my goodness, and you will always find a light of hope that will illuminate your path. Remember that every experience you go through, no matter how difficult, is shaping your character and preparing you for the purpose I have reserved for you. So do not fear or be discouraged because I have wonderful plans for you. Trust that every challenge is strengthening you. Every tear is being counted and every pain is being transformed into a source of blessing. My child, I invite you to believe in me with all your heart. Though the path may seem dark and difficult, I am the light that guides your steps. Do not worry about understanding every detail, but rest in my love. Trust that everything has a purpose and that I am working in all things for your good. On this day, walk firmly toward the future of blessing I have reserved for you. Walk with the certainty that my love will never fail you and that my purpose for you is to bless, prosper, and make you happy in all areas of your life. Be calm, you will succeed. Your problems, conflicts, and needs will not overcome you. Dear daughter, you carry heavy and difficult problems. You face a severe financial crisis. The days you live in this difficult situation are long. But I want to remind you that you are not alone. You do not have to fight in your own strength. I am here for you, beloved daughter. I am not indifferent to your difficulties. I am near, ready to help you, to be your strength and unbreakable support. I understand how heavy those burdens are on your shoulders. I see how your worries keep you up at night and how every tear you shed in solitude only afflicts your soul. But let me tell you today that you are not alone. And every one of your worries matters deeply to me. I am not ignorant of what is happening to you, nor am I distant from your needs. I can see what you are going through. You feel like all the doors are closing and the paths you walk are becoming dark. But I want to remind you that even in the midst of darkness, my light can shine intensely. You just have to believe in me and your problems will become opportunities. Adversity will turn into strength and wisdom. You need to understand, my child, that my plans for you are for good, greater than you can imagine. I do not seek to limit you, but to give you a bright future of prosperity and hope. Although sometimes trials are just the crucible in which I forge your character and awaken your talents so that you can achieve what you set out to do with faith and determination. That is why it is necessary for you to believe in me, my child. Trust in my provision, and you will see that even in the midst of scarcity, I can open doors of abundance. In the midst of confusion, I can guide you to clarity. Do not be overwhelmed by present needs because my grace is more than sufficient for you. Only I can reverse your situation, transforming your scarcity into abundance, your sorrow into joy, and your tears into laughter. Remember that nothing is impossible for me. Trust in me and your worries will disappear. 
I will provide everything you need and do amazing things in your life, much greater than you can ask or imagine. Today I encourage you to keep hope alive in your heart. Do not be discouraged by current circumstances or give up, because what you see as a defeat today can be the prelude to a great victory. Do not fear criticism, nor let fear paralyze your dreams. Trust in me and in your potential to overcome any challenge, for you are a conqueror. Your worth far exceeds that of precious stones. Therefore, dear child, understand that as you go through this dark valley, you are not alone. I am with you, holding your hand. Remember that I have given you a spirit of power and have placed faithful and suitable people of faith around you who can support you and lift your burdens with you. Seek support in them, and together you will experience my pure and tangible love. Through them, I will pour out grace and blessing upon you. Do not fear asking for help when you need it. Do not hesitate to come to me. You are not a failure for needing support. You are human. And while you are in this world, you will face struggles, trials, and difficulties. But if you trust in me, I assure you that everything will be fine. Do not rush or seek quick and immediate solutions. Wait with faith, for my timing is perfect. I am working in your favor so that you come out victorious from the storm you're living through. In the meantime, keep going forward and do not underestimate the power of perseverance and patience, for it is through faith and patience that my promises are inherited. Dear child, strive and continue to be brave. Do not allow yourself to fall into despair. Do not let the enemy steal your dreams. Even if the storm seems endless, the sun always comes out after the fiercest storm. Do not give up. Keep your faith and trust that I'm working in your life in a special way. I assure you that you will triumph and achieve all that you set out to do, because for those who love me and trust in me, all things work together for good. I love you, my child, more than you can imagine. Trust in me with all your heart, and do not let life's difficulties make you doubt my love for you. I am here to dry your tears, heal your wounds, and guide you toward the full and abundant life you deserve. I will show you the way out of all your problems. I will provide for your needs. My child, I speak to you with love and understanding in this moment of difficulty you are going through. Take my hand and let me lead you out of all your problems. I am here to listen to your words and respond to your pleas because your prayers have reached my presence. And I, am working to guide you to the solution of all your problems and provide for your needs. I know that life's path often presents challenges that seem overwhelming, but you must remember that you are not alone on your journey. I am here extending my hand to support you in the midst of the storm and guide you to the calm and clarity you long for. Let me be your refuge in times of tribulation your light in the darkness, and your strength in weakness. When the weight of your worries seems too heavy, remember that you can lay them at my feet. I am here to lighten your burdens and renew your strength. Do not be afraid to share your fears and anxieties with me, for in my love you will find comfort and hope. Trust that every step you take in faith towards me is a step closer to the peace and liberation you seek. The decisions you made in the past, no matter how wrong they may have been, do not determine your final destiny. In my infinite mercy, I always offer you forgiveness and the chance to start anew. Accept the grace I offer you and let my power transform your heart and mind. Leave behind the weight of remorse and guilt. Embrace the freedom that comes from reconciliation with me and with yourself. As you immerse yourself in the depth of my love, you will find the strength to forgive yourself and others. The compassion and understanding that flow from my being will surround you, healing the wounds of your soul 
and restoring your inner peace. You just need to trust in me and in the healing process I offer to renew your spirit and transform your life. My child, in the midst of uncertainty and adversity, always keep faith in me and in my power to perform miracles in your life. Do not be discouraged by the obstacles you may face, because every challenge is an opportunity to grow and strengthen yourself. These are only situations that will bring you closer to the purpose for which you were called. Remember that every experience, no matter how painful, has a purpose in my divine plan for you. Through trials and tribulations, I am forging your character and shaping your spirit so that you reflect my light and my love to the world. Trust that every tear shed is a seed of transformation, and every whisper of pain is an opportunity to grow in compassion and wisdom. Do not fear asking for help when you need it, for I have placed loved ones, people of faith and wise individuals around you, to accompany you on your journey through life. So open your heart and mind. Do not close your ears to the advice that comes from me. I am with you in every beat of your heart and in every breath of your soul. It is I who will guide and comfort you in the midst of the trial. I will take care of you when the storm is fierce and raging. So when you face moments of difficulty and tribulation, remember that you're surrounded by my unconditional love and healing grace. Trust that I'm working in your life to take you to levels of fulfillment and realization. I will never let you go. Just let my light illuminate your path and my love restore your being. Thus, in every step you take towards me, you will find comfort, strength, and hope to keep going. Remember, my child, that you are loved beyond measure and that your life has a unique and special divine purpose, a purpose that only you can fulfill. So trust that every step you take towards me brings you closer to your blessing. That is why you must be strong and brave, my beloved child. Do not see your circumstances as a limitation or weakness. See yourself as I see you. In my eyes, you are more than a conqueror. You are my child, strong, and created in my image and likeness. In you resides my divine power that enables you to overcome any obstacle and conquer any adversity. My child, receive these words. May my love renew and sustain you in this moment of need. May my peace, which surpasses all understanding, fill your heart and mind, and may you walk with the certainty that my power is greater than any challenge you may face. On this day, my child, on this beautiful morning, receive my love, grace, and blessing. Receive this knowing that you carry my light within you and my love as a protective shield. I will reward your faith and fill you with abundant blessings. I will pour grace and favor upon you before men my beloved child, today I look upon you from above with infinite love. I see every step you take in your journey. I behold your constant effort to improve day by day. I notice how even in your moments of weakness and discouragement, you continue with unbreakable determination on the path of faith. For despite facing great problems, you do not give up. You always strive to bear a good testimony of me. Day by day, I witness how you carry overwhelming burdens on your shoulders to provide better for your family. I have seen the silent tears you shed in the privacy of your prayers. Today, I want you to know that your petitions have not been ignored. They have all reached my ears. Every time you come to me and give me your heart, I feel joy in the depths of my being. I know you have had moments of uncertainty when the veil of doubt clouded your thoughts wondering if the long-awaited answer to your prayers would ever come. I know that in those moments of pain and anguish, the enemy whispered words of despair, trying to break your faith and undermine your courage. He has come only to steal, kill, and destroy. 
but I have come to give you life, and life in abundance. Therefore I urge you to continue believing and fighting for what you know to be true. Do not give up, my child. Be strong and courageous, for your time has come. The moment you have long awaited has arrived. I'm always attentive to your cries, and this is the perfect moment I have kept for you. Today I want to tell you that I will reward your faith and fill you with abundant blessings. I will pour out grace and favor upon you before those around you. You will never be ashamed again, for I will guide each of your steps. Today, I am showering you with opportunities and blessings that will make you a prosperous person. No more financial scarcity, no more debts, for I declare blessings upon you that will enrich your life in every aspect, both materially and spiritually. Your heart will rejoice, and you will sing songs of gratitude in my name. Just keep trusting in me, because I will overflow your life with wonderful blessings. My grace will bestow creativity upon you, provide you with resources, and open up opportunities in everything you undertake. Be assured in your heart that I will always be present at the right time when your needs require my intervention. I only ask that you persist in your faith, for in it you will find the strength to endure the trials and challenges that life presents. Do not let hope fade within you. Remember that my promises are firm and my commitment to you is sure. I will not leave you until my purpose is fulfilled in your life in a supernatural way. So do not fear facing struggles and trials, because when you do, I will be with you. No matter how many times life's storms shake you, I will always hold you in my loving arms. Keep your eyes fixed on me, for I am the source of your strength and hope. When you feel overwhelmed with fatigue, let me carry your burdens, for I am here to support you. Never doubt my faithfulness for every promise I have made will be fulfilled at the perfect time. Remember that you are not alone. I am with you in every struggle, in every trial, at every crossroad of your life. I am always with you in moments of joy as well as in moments of difficulty. Do not forget that you are my precious creation, formed with a divine purpose and endowed with talents. So when you face difficult decisions and have to climb the highest mountain, Seek my wisdom in the knowledge of my word. There you will find answers that will guide you on the right path. My spirit who dwells within you will provide you with discernment and clarity in the midst of confusion. Remember that I love you just as you are. My love for you does not depend on your achievements or merits, but is an unconditional gift that I offer you. My child, Keep moving forward with determination and faith. Walk always with courage on the path of righteousness and truth. Do not be afraid to take steps of faith because my presence is always with you. Move forward with hope, knowing that you have a heavenly Father who loves you with an unbreakable love, who will guide and sustain you until the end. Today I bless you and declare you free from chains, restored in your finances, and prosperous in all your ways. My beloved child, in this moment of communion, I speak to you with words full of promises and power. Listen attentively, for I wish to engrave them deep in your heart. I am your Heavenly Father, the Almighty God who cares for you at all times, and it is because of my inexhaustible love for you that I have decided to speak to you and reveal my purpose for your life. I want you to know that I know your needs and desires even before you express them. That is why I come to you today to tell you that I will supply all your needs, grant the desires of your heart, and restore your finances. So do not fear, my child, nor be surprised by what I will do in your life. For I will restore all areas of your being. I will heal your soul and restore the peace you have lost. 
the debts that burden you will be paid off. Everything that seems impossible to overcome, you will overcome, because I will be with you, giving you the strength and push necessary to move forward. I promise that everything you do will prosper. Your efforts, your work, and your dedication will not be in vain. Every seed you sow in faith will sprout and bear abundant fruit. There will be no financial commitment that you cannot meet. Because I will give you wisdom to manage the blessings I will place in your hands. You will see how the doors of blessing open before you. Prosperity will come to your life in all its forms, materially, emotionally, and spiritually, improving your life and the lives of those around you greatly. But remember, my beloved child, that prosperity is not only about earthly riches, it is a state of fullness that encompasses all areas of your existence. As you prosper, I ask you to remain faithful in the little, and I promise that I will place you in much. Do not forget that my blessing is a call to obedience and responsible stewardship of all that I entrust to you. So keep your heart humble and generous, ready to share with those in need, with those who have less. Prepare your heart and let me make you a channel of blessing to multitudes. My child, do not ignore that on your path you will find challenges and obstacles that will test your faith. But do not fear, for I will be with you in every step you take, strengthening and guiding you. Do not let adversity discourage you, for it is in the test that your character is forged and the trust you have in me is revealed. Remember, my child, that my purpose for you transcends the material. Although I will restore your finances and your debts will be paid, my greatest desire is for you to experience a profound spiritual transformation, for your relationship with me to be strengthened, and your faith to be refined in every victory and every challenge overcome. Trust in my word. I will not fail you, for I am faithful and keep my promises. There is no limit to my love and my power. If you cling to me, if you place your trust in my mighty hands, you will experience the flow of my supernatural blessings in your life. So hold on to my love and my grace, my beloved child, and live with the certainty that your finances will be restored, your debts will be paid, and all your financial burdens will be lifted. Lack will not touch your home, nor your children, nor your children's children because I will fill you with abundance in all areas of your life. Do not fear, for my grace is more than sufficient for you, and my mercy is eternal. Walk in obedience and faithfulness, trusting that I will never abandon you nor forsake you. You will be a living testimony of my miraculous provision, and those around you will see that my promises are faithful and true in your life. So, my child, receive this word with joy and gratitude in your heart. Declare with conviction that your finances will be restored, your debts will be paid, and that everything you do will prosper. Because you are my beloved child, and I want to see you walk in the fullness of my provision and blessing. I only ask, my child, that you keep your heart open to my voice and my direction. In every step you take, seek my wisdom and trust in my perfect plan for your life. Do not be discouraged by adversities, for with them you will find opportunities to grow and be strengthened. The faith you have placed in me will be abundantly rewarded. From today, do not worry about tomorrow, nor be afraid of what stands in your way. Keep your eyes on me the author and finisher of your faith. Trust that I am your provider and that I will never abandon you. My love for you is unconditional and my desire is to see you prosper in all areas of your life. My beloved child, keep these words within you. Place them as a seal so that they serve as a constant reminder of my commitment to you. 
of my unconditional love, and of my desire to bless you abundantly. Today in my name I bless you and declare you free from debts, restored in your finances, and prosperous in all your ways. Hello, I am Jesus. Do you have a moment for me? How are you? I appreciate every time you dedicate a few minutes to talk with me. I see your walk and the intentions of your heart. I know you have been living through difficult days, but in these moments, I want you to forget everything you are going through and listen to me. You are strong. You have a brave heart. You have what it takes to face these moments of trial. You are refined like pure gold. You are the most beautiful of my creation. You have fire within you. Do not abandon those dreams I have planted in you, those desires I have placed in your heart. You are a strong warrior. With the sword of faith you will overcome. No one can take this victory from you that comes to your arms. Neither the heights nor the depths nor the enemy with all his armies will dare to challenge me. I rescued you, breathed divine life into you. I saw you faint and my love for you lifted you up. I did so many things so that you could be here in these moments. Meditate on this love I have for you, for it is special. The time has come to reveal to you what I have for you in a supernatural way. I want you to prepare for the new things I have for you. You are about to see a great change. Many people will be amazed by you. They will see how you are a living testimony of my power, of the infinite power of your God, your Father, your Shepherd. They will see me reflected in you. Your face will change. I want to use you to bring healing to the sick, to be a blessing to your neighbor. You will be the instrument, like clay in the hands of the potter. I will make you a useful and holy vessel. Do not doubt. I tell you the truth. Tell me that you believe it. You're going to change. I will transform you. Believe it. Just surrender. Allow me to work in you. Do not hide anything from me. Tell me everything in prayer. I will change every part of your being, filling every corner of your soul. The time has come. The door is opening. Do not fear what you will find when you cross this door, for I am with you. Take my hand, hold on tight, and walk with me. This path will lead you to a new life, where you will be filled with blessings and sing songs of grace. Listen to me well. Pay attention to my words. I am attentive to your prayers. I will continue to love you, regardless of the decisions you make. You have my support in whatever you undertake. I will continue to watch over you. Come to me every morning in prayer. Do not remain silent. Do not hesitate to ask me for advice or help. I will guide you. Perhaps everything seems confusing right now, but do not focus on the tree. Look at the forest. Do not focus on the problem, but on the solutions. Holding my hand, you will overcome any barrier. Walls will be broken down, and you will receive your divine promise. Remember, many are called, but few are chosen. Many start on this path, but give up halfway. I ask that when things look bleak, do not give up. I will be by your side, giving you strength, but you must believe and not lose your faith. Even if it is as small as a mustard seed, Take this victory that I place in your hands. Receive this divine breath that I blow upon you. No matter how great your trial, do not be afraid. No matter how big your problems are, do not give up. Tell me that it will be so. Write it in your own words. Declare it with all your being. Tell me that you will not be afraid. Lift your eyes to heaven. Rise like the eagles. Where you are, my spirit is. Engrave these words in your heart, for they are a seal of strength and excellence. These days will be decisive, marking a before and after. Do not fear anymore. Do not be afraid, for the Lion of Judah, your Lord and God, is with you. 
Today I want to talk to you about the blessings I have prepared for you. Even before you were born, I was preparing you for great things. I have designed a plan for your life, a plan filled with successes, achievements, and goals, but also challenges, difficulties, and trials. Through them, you will know that I am with you at all times, holding and guiding you toward the fulfillment of your purpose. I know that sometimes things do not turn out as you hoped, that doors close and obstacles multiply. You may have experienced losses, disappointments, or failures that have made you doubt yourself, your abilities, and my love for you. But today I come to remind you that none of that defines who you are or limits what you can achieve. I have placed strength and determination within you so that you always have the courage, faith, and perseverance to move forward even when circumstances seem difficult. I promise that with every step you take, I will be with you, holding and guiding you with my loving hand. In my presence you will find strength, comfort, and direction. You will see that what seemed impossible becomes possible. In this world, you will face chaos, noise, and confusion, making it difficult to find the way. But I assure you that if you seek my presence, immerse yourself in my word, and meditate on my promises, you will find peace that surpasses all understanding. Your thoughts will be ordered, your emotions stabilized, and your spirit renewed. In me, you will always have well-being in all areas of your life. Remember that it is my will for you to prosper in everything. My desire is for you to succeed in all you undertake so that it always goes well with you. I want you to have health for your body is the temple of my spirit and I want you to take care of it with love and diligence. Also take care of your mind, your emotions and your spirit. Do not let stress, anxiety, or fear dominate you. Believe in me and in my love for you, and you will see how life becomes a wonderful gift. Remember, my child, that my blessings for you are not over. Never forget that I have given you talents, abilities, and special gifts to achieve all that you set out to do. Use the potential within you to glorify me and bless others. Do not settle for the minimum, but always seek to give your best in everything you do. If you maintain an attitude of gratitude, humility, and service, you will see opportunities arise. Trust in me, my child, for my blessings have not run out for you. You are blessed and will be greatly blessed. Do not be impatient because of those who do wrong. Stay away from those people and walk in my righteousness. For by your unwavering faith, I will work in your favor and bring peace and well-being to your life. Today, you need to know that I come to bless you in a supernatural way, and that these words you hear are life and truth. Do not be afraid. Do not let anything intimidate you. For you are my child, and you are destined to be blessed on this earth. I chose you to be a light and to shine in this world even before you were formed in your mother's womb. Let me take you by the hand and guide you to your destiny. Let me fight for you so that you may conquer all your struggles. I am blessing you not only materially, but also with wisdom. I am increasing your prudence. I am changing your character and giving you much patience. I am transforming your life completely. Let my spirit cover you and fill you from head to toe. You will no longer walk into error. You will no longer desire to sin. You will no longer be weak to temptations. Today I bless you and give you the faith and strength to live in freedom and abundance, far from sin. From today onwards you will be known as the blessed, the prospered by God. For new blessings will come. You will experience supernatural things. You will receive all the things I have promised in my word. Your life will never be the same. My child, the things I will do in you 
will surprise those around you. They will see my grace and favor in your life. Everyone will see that my power is real and that it is available to those who choose to believe. Be brave and strive for excellence in everything you do, for only then will you reach your goals. Only then will you achieve your destiny. Do not stop nor be discouraged by those who murmur against you. Stay away from those who only do harm with their actions and words. Do not forget that I will be with you, strengthening and blessing your path. Do not stop dreaming or desiring my blessings because I want to bless you in ways you never imagined. Just put all your trust in me and nothing and no one will be able to prevent your destiny from being greatly blessed. No one in this world can prevent my blessing upon you. Neither principalities nor powers can stop me from blessing you, for my grace and favor will be poured out upon your life. So open your arms this day and receive these words, because today a shower of blessings falls upon you, leading you to paths of prosperity and success, to places where peace reigns and joy will be your companion where every step you take will be marked by my inexhaustible love and divine protection. Do not doubt these words, for they are faithful and true. They are promises that today reveal themselves to you with clarity and love, manifesting my purpose to bless you in amazing ways, ways that surpass any obstacle and adversity, even the most difficult circumstances. So continue with faith and courage because from today, your life will not be the same. Your sadness is over. No more pain or suffering. Today is a new day where I will fulfill every one of my promises in you. Everything you have always longed for will be granted. I will make you a prosperous and victorious person. I will set you as the head and not the tail. These things are not by chance, but the desire of my good and perfect will. Receive these words. Receive them with joy, for everything you are hearing is just the beginning of the good things you will experience in me. For your destiny is to triumph. Just trust in me, and you will achieve your goals in everything you do. Your dreams and aspirations will come true. Your deepest desires will be fulfilled. Nothing in this world can prevent these things, neither the attacks of the evil one, nor the slanders or murmurs of malicious people. Nothing will stop you, because I will help you achieve everything you set out to do, and no one will prevent me from blessing you in an amazing way. I want you to know that I will not only multiply your material goods, but I will also make you abound in love, patience, and wisdom. I will place grace in your life so that when you face work challenges or difficulties, you will find opportunities to grow, learn, and be a testimony of my greatness before the eyes of those who do not believe. I will put a renewed spirit in you. You will no longer have to live worried or anxious. I will restore in you everything that the enemy and this world tried to steal. All the gifts and blessings in the spiritual realm are yours and they already belong to you. So rise and move forward. Do not stop. Take confident and firm steps on your path to success and prosperity. Remember that I will be with you, holding you in my hands, and I will never let you go. So move forward without fainting. Cast doubt and fear from your mind. Move forward with the certainty that I bless and prosper you on this beautiful day. My child, in your hands, I place my promises of love and blessing so you can keep them in your heart as a precious treasure. Trust in my faithfulness and care for you. Trust that in me, you will find the strength and wisdom to face any challenge or difficulty that comes your way. Do not fear the future or be anxious about the unknown, for I have plans of good for you, plans that will give you hope and a future full of blessings. Trust in my purpose 
and the beautiful blessings I will pour into your life. Everything you need will be given to you in abundance because I am a generous and faithful God, a Father who always keeps His promises. Today I encourage you to move forward with courage and determination, to walk with firm steps and a brave heart, knowing that my light illuminates your path and my love sustains you at all times. Do not stop on your path of faith. Remain in my word and obey my voice. Listen to my counsel and I assure you that everything will go well for you. If you need to hear my voice in your soul, my written word is there. Open its pages. Go through them with faith and love. Keep them in your mind. Treasure them in your heart. Believe them with passion and obey them with loyalty. Then your heart will leap with joy and your spirit will rejoice, for they will fill you with faith and confidence to achieve all that you set out to do. From today, may you live a life full of blessing and abundance. May my provision be your sustenance, my love your guide, and my word your nourishment. May this message be like a balm for your soul, renewing and strengthening you in my love. May my peace, which surpasses all understanding, fill your heart and give you the certainty that I am with you at all times. Receive my words and walk with the assurance that my blessing always accompanies you, for my desire is to see you grow and flourish from today and forever. Amen.